Hello and welcome back to Smoking Dragon Plays Night in the Woods. Back here after having our little fun at the mall, shooting people with a fountain and about to head to bed. Probably could have uh, bedtime. Like I was saying, I was probably I probably could have done this in the last episode, gone to sleep, but I forgot to set my timer, so I wasn't sure how long I'd been recording for, and it turned out it was actually kind of a short episode last time, so I apologize for that. But no harm, no foul. Go ahead and get into the next day. Not much plot. Oh, another dream sequence. I love these. Oh, I don't have my bat this time. Ooh. Light came on. I should have my bat. I like smashing stuff. Creepy uh, ghost playing a violin. Plays pretty well. Let's see what's up here. Some uh, creepy birds. I guess I have to turn on all these lanterns, is what I'm guessing. Let's see if we can jump onto the power lines. Yep. We'll try. Oh, it's like a solar eclipse. It's not really night, it's like uh, daytime. There's the constellations that we learned about a couple episodes ago. A creepy ghost bear thing playing a tuba with a plus sign on it. Could be day, could be night. More birds. Get off my power line. Jump up here. Yes. Let's see what this is. Saxophone by a uh, bird ghost. Music going on. It's pretty thematic. Turn on this one. And see what we got here. Are we playing the drums, maybe? Oh, there's Bay playing the uh, accordion. one. Jump on down. What are those things? Looks like it started to rain. Is that somebody there? Can't tell. Interesting. That was interesting. Actually glad that I started off the episode with it. Alright, let's get up and get our shoes on. See what's on the old computer. Maybe play some Demon Tower, see if I can get past that second level. Oh, Greg has something for us. Morning. I'm working today. Angus is out of town and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. Sincerely, Gregory. What's in the news? Science beat. Jobs cannot be soul crushing because that there is no proof that soul is exist. Oh, that's <laughs> I wonder what kind of news outlet that is. Demon Tower, let's get into it. Continue. Level 2. The 
this cell, or is that level 11? I'm going to say it's level 2. I'm already done with this, so I'm just going to try to sprint my way to the uh, place to get the key. That was actually over in another direction. No, it was over here, right? Nope. Damn it. Alright. Um, probably should get some help at some point. Try that again next time, I think. Yes, I want to surrender to the horror. I'm very good at that game, apparently. Alright, let's head on down, see what our parents have for us today. I wonder if Dad uh, cleared out the closet for us yet. Nope. done that yet. Check out the bird. What are you even what are you even thinking about in there? It's a good question. He doesn't really move or do anything. Oh. Is mom back here? Yep, there she is. Good morning, did you feel it last night? No? Or what? What? There's a big sinkhole two streets over. Oh, are we still getting those? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground and so forth, and on a floodplain. Oh, weird. I don't want you over. I don't want you over there nosing around it. I'm definitely going to do that. I guarantee you won't. I guarantee you I won't. I have seen sinkholes. No interest at all. Mom, they're just holes in the ground. Get back to me when, like, one of them swallows a house or something. I'll go see if... We'll go see together if that happens. Deal. So what did you do last night? Went to the mall with Bay. Oh, Fort Lettuce? <laughs> yeah. I haven't been there in years. How is it? Kind of falling apart and empty. Yeah, I expect. Everyone just goes to the outlet stores up by the interstate now. For, you know, shoes and things. I'll stop by the church if you're in the area. Will do, Mom. See ya. Hmm. Bye, sweetie. Now that you've been home for a few days, yeah? Have you thought about getting a... Well, gotta go, Mom. Heh <laughs> heh. Bye, sweetie. Hmm. 
Okay, I guess that's all she has. I'm wondering when they're gonna start asking her to get a job. You can't stay, you can't live at home for so long before your parents say, oh, when are you getting a job? When are you getting a job? Now oh, this place is still blocked off, so I guess the sinkhole is to the left. See what's over here. Grumpy pants. May Borowski. Smellers or Selmers, I should say. Now we know how important it looks. Now we all know how important it is to look our best. What? Our appearance is the first and sometimes last impression we make. Selmers, do you, did you join a cult? Lucky for you, I happen to be a licensed dealer. Oh, okay. Of the Silent Family Products. Family of Products. Selmers, I don't have any money. Oh, okay. Are you gonna give that pitch to everyone? Have you sold anything yet? So I guess, uh, old Selmers is in doing, like, Amway or Mary Kay or one of those things. Sold some to my mom. And to Abby Krangler. This Krangler's daughter? Granddaughter. I run into at the laundromat over by the school. One time Greg got locked inside one of the tumble dryers. Did he die? He wanted to make he wanted me to start it, but I chickened out. He definitely would have died. Tell him that. He's still mad. Wanna hear a poem? Nah, no, maybe another time. Sure. Sometimes, I think. And start to sink. Oh no, there's more. Sorry. Then I remember, it's October. October. I comb my two favorite months. I combine my two favorite months. October and what? December or September? Fall is really nice. Remember? It's the best. Days are gonna start getting shorter now. It makes me sad. I like it. I love the fall, but hate the dark. I like it. You sure do. I've seen a raccoon. Yeah, they're all over the place here. Where? Up in Towny Sentry. He's a big one. Cool. Yeah, there's... Does she mean... I guess she means a real raccoon, not like a senian raccoon. Let's see what this guy who really hates it when we're on his turf. My cat don't like... My cat don't like folks on the porch. Alright. I'm a cat. I wonder if you would, uh, like it fun there. It looks like it's, uh, almost Halloween here. So we must have got back sometime early to mid, uh, mid-October, maybe late October is when we got back. So May made it at least a couple months into her sophomore year, sophomore year at college. Still don't know why she left. Anything in here? Anything new? Harvest Fest, October 20, yeah. Casey's still missing. Nothing new here. That is, um... There's a raccoon. Oh, I just walked behind the store. The call center people. Still hanging out, not doing much. Um, uh, let's go over here and, uh... See what our friends are doing before we head to the church. Stop by May's work. Still at work. Hey, baby. Hey, May. How's it going? Got a lot of, got a load of rock salt to move. Came in early this year. So I guess they use it to like uh, keep the streets from getting iced over. I'm like a crap load of snow shovels. Usually the distro place doesn't goof up like this. Maybe it's won by weather wizards. Yeah, that's not a bad theory. So what's up? Wanna hang out tonight? Uh, I'm working. If you wanna like, come along. Oh, I was thinking we'd go play putt-putt out at Hunwick. Out in Hunwick. Hey, that's actually not a bad idea. But sorry, gotta work. Aw, oh, geez, what is even the point? Paychecks, rent, food, medicine, that kind of thing. So you want to come along or not? 
Gotta do a lot today. Let's hang out. Let's hang out. Hope we don't hang out right now. It's still... Oh, damn it. I wanted to go see what else was going on. House call. Yeah, yeah, I guess that kind of just... Ended that day. Couldn't you just, like, refuse to do house calls? Nope. Why? It's called a job. People pay you to do it. Ideally, at least. You coming? There's a thing back here by the driveway. Yeah, she's an old lady. She's got weird shit in her yard. It's like a windmill. Yep. I've never been back up here before. May Borowski, you have n now been here. It's nice. <laughs> yeah, just a bunch of old cabins people turned into houses. Some hunting camps. So don't got get so don't like get shot or anything. Buck season isn't for a few days, right? Well, folks get impatient. For murder. It ain't murder if it's animals. Huh? Oh god, I'm not even gonna address that. That's dark. Hold that thought. You gonna knock? I guess she knocked, I couldn't tell. Thank you much. Thank you for coming on such short notice. No problem. I can see through a four alarm fire by that furnace. I'll take a look at it. Ever since Jean passed, I can't get a I can't abide that thing thumping. Understandable. Jean was such a darling man. Hey, what do you mean by hold that thought? Wait for it? I'll never forgive them for taking him away. Uh-huh. Ain't like I didn't treat him right. I looked it up on the internet. He didn't smell or nothing. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Wait for it. You can't take a woman's husband just because he's dead. Oh, that's, uh, that's really a good thought right there. There it is. Holy God. Took him right off that couch. It's a crime. Yeah, a crime was definitely committed, all right. They just couldn't abide by not being able to tax them anymore. That's what it was. Yeah, I'm sure that's what it was. Well, I won't talk your ears your ears off about it. Come take a look. At, come take a look at my fridge while you're here. We'll bill by the half hour. All right, that's uh, interesting. Good job. Yeah, it was a nice fridge. What's the problem? It's a nice fridge. What's the problem? Oh, there's no problem. It's just a classic, an old Luna Freeze. Wow. They're all the they were all the rage when I when I was your age. They last forever. They make me feel so young. I saw one of these the other night when I got back into town. Oh really? Where? Upside down under some logs in a creek in a ravine. Alright. So, furnace! <laughs> Oh yes, right through here to the basement. Sounds good. Come on, May. Alright, we'll be down there for a bit. Please remember not to lock us in. What? Last time we sent someone, he got locked in the basement. I assure you that did not happen. Um, he called me from your basement. Your man did smell a bit of booze when he came by. Oh, okay. Busted. Or something. Okay, down we go. It was nice meeting you. I don't really know who you are, little person. Oh man, I love creepy... I'm gonna get this right one of these days. Oh man, I love creepy basements. And why wouldn't you? Look at all this. Splendor. Jeez, she's got a lot of junk. Maybe she's got a few more husbands stacked in the corner. Heh <laughs> heh. Alright, let's get this done so we can go home. Alright, um, it's been about 20 minutes, so I'll cut the episode here, and we'll try to fix this uh, old lady's furnace and hopefully not get locked in. I'll see you guys on the next episode. Thanks for watching.